Dear Tswani residents, in the past few days, there have been a number of wildcat strikes that have broken out in parts of the city, affecting our ability to respond, especially to power outages, although in all likelihood the bus service of the city will be affected today. We think that these wildcat strikes and stoppages are in all likelihood related to the fact that the city has not budgeted for salary increases in the present financial year. And because the Municipal Council resolved that the city should approach the Bargaining Council to ask for an exemption to these increases. Now the fact is we would obviously like to pay increases to our people uh, to reward the hard work of officials but the point is in our present financial situation we simply can't afford to. Uh, we will be paying in the region of 600 million rand more in salaries if we were to grant these increases. So those official processes must follow. Uh, but I want to just remind residents as well as employees of the city where we are at the moment, if anyone is in any doubt. We're here to execute a rescue mission. We want to save the city from financial ruin so that we have the ability to over time improve services and ensure the financial sustainability of the city. We implore employees of the city to wait and to follow proper processes when registering grievances, but it's also important that residents understand the bigger context of things going on. I have the greatest respect for organized labor, for train, trade union membership, and even for the right to strike if it is exercised in a responsible, lawful way. So tomorrow, one of the large trade unions will be coming to Tswane to uh, hand over a memorandum of their grievances. And together with the city manager, I welcome the opportunity to receive those grievances and to address workers on the financial situation of the city and of the broader picture of what we're trying to achieve. In essence, we're all in this together. And what we must avoid are those who are trying to turn us against each other or to suggest that resources are unlimited. The financial rescue of the city of Tswane is in the best interests of employees and of residents and we will be as clear and candid and open with the public as well as our workforce on this issue in the months ahead.